Hi, in this video tutorial, I am going to discuss the cranial nerves, the 10 cranial nerves that exit the brain stem or enter. So you have the spinal cord here. Here are the structures of the brain stem, right? The midbrain here at the top, the pons under midbrain, and the middle oblongata. So, uh, if we draw the first cranial nerve, it will exit the front of the midbrain, the third cranial nerve, okay? And this is the fourth cranial nerve that goes back and exit from the backside of the midbrain and then comes again from an exit from the front. So, the, this is your fifth cranial nerve which is also called the trigeminal nerve since it has three branches or it divides into three branches. Here if I draw the inferior pontine sulcus and then I draw, uh, divide the medulla into uh, the pyramids and olive, okay? And here is your sixth cranial nerve that emerges. Here your seventh cranial nerve here your eighth cranial nerve. Okay, it's very easy. Come in order, fifth, sixth, seven, and eight. And now I'll draw the inferior peduncle that connects the medulla to the cerebellum. And here you will have your ninth cranial nerve, the tenth cranial nerve, and the eleventh cranial nerve with its spinal branch, it has two branches, one from the spinal cord, one from the brainstem. And here is your 12th cranial nerve. And this was your lateral view. Now I will draw a frontal view and show how these nerves, they emerge from the brainstem. The two nerves that I haven't discussed, olfactory and the optic, they do not emerge from the brain stem. So here I draw another frontal wheel. Here is the diagram. So here at the top is your uh, midbrain with aqueduct. And here, here is your pons and the inferior pontine sulcus. And here uh, pyramids and, uh, sorry, here olive, pyramids, pyramids and olive, okay? Here is your inferior peduncle, inferior peduncle, okay. So the first nerve that emerges, it will uh, exit from the interpeduncular uh, posa, right? The interpeduncular fossa, okay. The fourth cranial nerve will go back and exit and come all the way back here to the front, the fourth cranial nerve, okay. This is how the fourth cranial nerve comes out and we have the fifth cranial nerve it will emerge from the pons okay it has three branches the fifth cranial nerve which is also called the trigeminal of course there are two fifth cranial nerves so we'll draw on the other side as well and then you have your uh, pyramids from pyramids you have the sixth cranial nerve uh, the sixth on the other side, the seventh, the seventh cranial nerves, and the eighth cranial nerve, okay? So, it's very easy if you remember in this pattern, okay? The ninth cranial nerve, your tenth cranial nerve, and eleventh cranial from the brainstem and spinal cord, two branches, remember? And the twelfth cranial nerve, of course, between pyramids and olive, as it emerges from there. So here's your 12th cranial nerve again. Uh, on the other side, 9th cranial nerve, 10th cranial nerve, and 11th cranial, two branches. Okay. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked it. Bye.